Our seventh presenter is Mohamed Ayaz Massoud, whose title is Laterally Actuating Phase Change Nano Relay for Non-Volatile Memory Operation. Your cloud storage is full. To upload this file, buy more space. Don't you hate that notification? But to be honest, the big cloud companies require space and energy to store your data. And believe it or not, more energy is lost due to leakage than what is required to upload, store, and download your files. With my research, we should be able to reduce that leakage energy to an absolute zero. Let me explain how. At the core of any electronic device, we have transistors. A transistor is a channel for electron to flow from a source to a drain controlled by a gate. Now, 20 years ago, the distance between the source and the drain was hundreds of nanometers. Today, they're only five to seven nanometers apart, barely 50 atoms. So when you are trying to turn it off, some electrons always find their way across, hopping on those few atoms. That is leakage. And as you have billions of transistors in an area of just one centimeter square, the total leakage adds up, significantly contributing to a warmer planet. So what could be the solution? Well, if we could remove those few atoms, creating a gap, electrons cannot jump across anymore. Hence, we get zero leakage. But in that case, how do you turn it on? You'd have to mechanically move the source towards the drain to make a physical contact on, off, on, off, just like a light switch, an electromechanical switch. And to be used as memory, it has to be stable in both on and off states. But to make a five nanometer size, stable, controllable, mechanically moving structure is almost impossible. So in our group, we redefine this architecture. We use germanium telluride, GET, a phase change material. We can change the volume of this material using electrical pulses. And that change is rapid, reversible, and stable. We put a thin metal layer on top of GET so that when it expands, it connects a source and drain, creating a channel for electron to flow. And as it shrinks back, the gaps reappear, perfect zero leakage. For my thesis, I have used this architecture to make nanoscale devices. These devices are comparable in size to today's transistors. I have made the devices vertical to further reduce their footprint. I developed nanofabrication techniques to deposit and pattern multiple layers of vertical thin films. Imagine a vertical stack of papers. Now imagine that in a nanoscale. In the off state, this device, this device indeed has zero leakage, and you can turn it on with lower voltage than conventional transistors. If you look at that pie chart, we're not going for a slice here, we're going for the entire pie. These devices have application in space technology, cloud memory, quantum computing, and artificial intelligence. Did I miss a buzzword? Zero leakage nanoscale memory has application in all realm of technology, so that the next time you upload a photo of your loved ones, only your heart gets warmer, not this planet. Thanks for listening. <laughs>